in a gathering like this imagine there's a gathering like this and today is ramadan 27th of ramadan the hafiz has finished the quran and we're having a whole extension to this masjid and i say brothers we've got this three million pound project here who's going to be the first one to stand up and to say that they're going to give 100,000 pounds to the masjid and i say that you're all sitting there and one brother gets up he says one hundred thousand pounds he's going to donate what are we all going to do what are we going to say that i'm going to say that's me here they go what are you going to say takbir takbir now we're going to bring the roof down a hundred thousand pounds man hundred thousand pounds and then i say who's the next brother and the brother stands up right at the back there and says i'm going to give one pound you see that one pound you see that just me with you we're all going to be laughing what are we going to do we're going to laugh yet the hadith says the prophet in abu Dawood, he says one man's one dirham has gone ahead and has superseded another man's 100,000 dirhams one man's one dirham is more than another man's 100,000 dirhams and they can't understand this so they say Messenger of Allah how how is it that is more and the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam explains and listen to this because you were excited with the first man giving a hundred thousand you were laughing with me at the second guy who stood up there and gave one pound and Allah's messenger explains he says as for the man who gave a hundred thousand dirhams he had a lot of wealth a lot of wealth so from his huge amount of wealth he gave a small portion which was one hundred thousand dirhams as for the other man he only had two dirhams you now understand the man who stood up at the back he only had two pounds that's all he had so when he gave his one pound and we looked down at him we didn't realize that the first man gave probably one or two percent of his wealth but the second man gave 50 percent of his wealth now you tell me who deserves the, the second man.